Hey everyone, what is going on? It's a good night. It's uh, it's the end of the summer for us. Summer is coming to a close, yes. right? And that means uh, school starts again. Uh, means a little bit more regular, like around the house. Yeah, just uh, yes. The schedule does not revolve around getting the kids to their practices and everything every couple hours you know that right. kind of stuff so it'll they will all be on the stage oh i didn't mean to remove i admit we're just gonna <laughs> start knocking everyone out of the business out of the, i didn't mean to do that i didn't right. mean to do that yeah and so uh <laughs> we are getting ready for school to start um we are, are getting ready to move into a new season and i love new seasons um i just yes. do um it's uh i guess being a teacher and a coach for I did it 19 years. They paid me. So 21, 22 years um, doing it. Um, you just get used to new season, right? It's a new season. Fall comes and, you know, basketball hits then baseball and then you get summer. So we're hitting new season and it just, it just excites me. Right. And so um, with that being said, since I'm already excited, I do want to go ahead and announce, I know not everyone's on here, um, but they will see the recording and I'll reach out to them. Yeah. Um, those who are doing uh, DML bingo, right? Those who are actively doing it, taking a picture of their paper and posting it. And listen, I'm doing it, but I am really bad about taking that screenshot and posting it. So I've got to do better. Uh, but those who don't miss, right? I need, oh, I hey, just in time, right? Um, I, I'll drag this out a little bit longer until she pops on here. Um, uh, I'm going to give out a couple just gifts just for being active and, and playing in the game and, and um, participating. So um, uh, two people that have been very active doing DMO bingo. Yeah. Um, one of them is Vivian. Um, I don't remember Vivian's last name or I don't know how to say it. Um, <laughs> but Ms. Vivian um, from Oregon, um, I am just amazed. We've been on a couple Zooms. We've done a couple launches. Um, we've talked with me and you kind of becoming friends right um so um vivian you are uh, one of the winners of dml bingo and um mariam i see you there um you hopped on just in time yeah uh mariam you are also uh, another winner of dml bingo um thanks for playing thanks for posting it's not over we still have a week and a half um left so on this coming wednesday um i will do another drawing and then i'll announce those on sunday and then the following Wednesday, we'll do another drawing that will end the month. But uh, those who are doing DMO bingo, those are not necessarily the bingo, but doing your DMOs every single day and committing to those things. Your business is growing. And um, there are some of you that are moving fast. Like I am seeing more and more people added um, to the group. I'm seeing more and more people. Man, there are a couple of you. Um, Dana... I, I know we bragged on you last time, but I am just amazed at the amount of people yeah. that you are connecting with on a daily basis and getting them inside disruptive wellness. And they are following the rules. They are typing your name in and saying, Dana invited me or Dana from the uh, um, long haul group. Right. And so I know that you, <laughs> I just do. Yep. Um, and so just, just amazed. And so that's, that's good. Right. We just uh, doing active, staying um, consistent in what we do. So, Miriam, um, great job. Vivian, great job. And Dana, I know I don't have an award for you, but congratulations. Great job. You're building your business. Right. Yeah. We see you and we are so proud of you. That's a well, big deal. let's OK. Let me brag on a couple other people. And, and because a couple of you are on here um, inside disruptive wellness, how does the group work? It's ad tag message, or we like to say message ad, ad tag, right? Um, so, scroll down. There you go. Um, inside that group, if you're just adding people, guess what? They're there. They get dripped on a little bit, but they have no clue you're there, right? They have no clue really what's going on. Um, if you're not making a post, probably weekly inside Disruptive Wellness, I would like to say... Um, once or twice a week with the group as large as it is, if each one of us made just one post, there's going to be so much content going through there every single week. Um, it's something that we wouldn't really have to worry about, but it's more than making the post. Selena, I am so stinking. Just you inspire me. I watch you tag people in the group. You, you know, your people, 
that you're bringing into the group and you know what posts that will resonate with them. And you go and you tag them. You're like, hey, check this out. These testimonies were awesome. Or, hey, this is what this is for you. You need to watch this. And I am just great job. Mm -hmm. uh, I, I, I am. Yeah, you're crushing her video. Her videos have been awesome, too. Thanks, Selena. Yes. 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 Right. Um, is Kelly. Um, I don't see her on here. There's a couple other people inside the group. I see you're working. Right. And I would be shocked if the business isn't growing. No. Right. No. Um, I just would be shocked. Well, I just across the board, everybody that's on the Zoom right now, like, thank you for just showing up. But also, like, I see each and every one of you adding value by a comment or liking and, and adding people to the groups like that. That right there is is a huge blessing, not only to us, but to everyone on this team. So anything, you know, that you add to um to all the groups it is it's valuable and it doesn't go unnoticed so thank you guys so much um i think ryan's got some ideas for you miss rosie so uh stay tuned oh i <laughs> forgot there you are miss <laughs> <laughs> rosie me and you are going to do a live inside disruptive wellness uh, I, I need your help so we're going to do that on wednesday Yes. We go ahead and make plans. Um, so um, with the new excitement and with the free time that we're getting ready to have, Kylie and I really sat down and talked and there's some commitments that I really want to make back to you guys because you guys have been so active and you're, and you're growing. I'm watching teams grow. Um, uh, we're going to see one team grow by over 20,000 in volume above what they've ever done this month. And uh, it, it's it's a so exciting. it's pretty impressive. Yeah. Um, so that um, that's just inspiring. And I know we do this business. We all do this business for multiple reasons. One, we love helping people. There's no one on this group that doesn't love just to help people. Yeah. Number two, we do it we make money, right? And that's what we do. But we also do this for time freedom, mm -hmm. right? And so time freedom has been one thing that that we kind of have taken advantage of this summer with all of our kids did over 120 ball <laughs> in 90 days. Um, we, we, we really focused on our family. Um, and so I appreciate you not, um, throwing a fit, um, yeah. because we weren't at everything or on everything, but at the same time, um, I want to return the favor. And so what we're going to do is we're going to really start to pour in more value inside disruptive wellness. Um, we don't want disruptive wellness to just be a turmeric group. I have no desire for that. Okay. If that's the case, people are going to feel like all you're trying to do is sell to them. Um, they're going to see the same stuff and that's it. So when we talk as leaders, we want disruptive wellness to be a, a, a group that gives tons of value, right? That leads to customers or non-customers, just members adding new people because they're like, man, this is great. So um, we're looking at like a wellness Wednesday and doing a Wednesday alive or just a, a really good post. Um, and I'm going to kick it off. I haven't even told Rosie and you're just going to, you're just committed <laughs> already. Um, but we're going to go in and talk about I love you so much. nutrition. Yeah. You know, we're going to talk about different things that you could be doing outside of using your curcumin plus and your nanofi and your symbiofi, but just different things that make life better, right? Yeah. There's so many great products out there. And, and I believe we have, if we don't have one of the best products on the planet, yeah. we have one of the close, it's one of the close ones just because of what it does and how many things it affects. But there's a lot of great products out there that a lot of different companies sell, but because people won't change the way they eat and change their activity, it really doesn't work the way it, uh, it could. Some people see great results, but it doesn't do that. So what we want to do is we want to take that group and turn it into more, right? So provide that stuff. Well, can I just make a point of yeah. what you're saying? Like there are a lot of, products out there on the market that are just like a band -aid, right we are one of the i don't know maybe we're one of the only 
that go to their get to the root. Right. We target the root cause right. of all of these issues that people are trying to shake up stuff and wipe on and wipe on else. and and but inhale. You know, we can attack that root, but if you don't attack the other root, the habits, yeah. we don't see life changing. Um, hold on. Like we yeah. don't see big changes that last. No one wants to be the person that helps someone to lose a lot of weight or help get their life right. And then in three years, you see them again or you run into each other. And like, yeah. Right. And so what we're going to do is we're going to try to really focus on different days of the week, bringing different content that is not related to these. Does that sound good? I hope so. Um, Rosie, we're going to do Wellness Wednesday. And uh, we're going to talk about um, this. I am, I'm putting more fruit. I didn't eat the rind of the watermelon or I didn't juice the rind of the watermelon like I saw in your video, but I, I licked on the rind, the white part, I didn't make it to the green. Um, I don't know. Um, but I watch what you do. And, and so I want to share that, right? Yeah. We want to get in there and we want to share it. Well, so. it just, across the board is leaving people better than we found them, right? right? Like we, we introduced them to this amazing product, but then how do we help them to maximize you know, the, the liquid blessing. Right. And so right. it is, it's, uh, there's so yeah. many more aspects. And so it. like, there's also, because my background is fitness, right? So maybe a fitness Friday or something where we talk about different exercises. So that being said, we're doing a, um, a bingo, a wellness bingo inside disruptive wellness. Um, and there are some participating. I've got people messaging me, um, but I would love, because I think a lot of you do more of this than you realize, I would love to see more people inside Disruptive Wellness doing that because I want to inspire some other people that just, they just need someone to inspire them, right? To get up and go for a walk, get up and go play with their kids. Listen, we, we pick things and put it on that DMO or not DMO, that wellness bingo sheet because we believe in a lot of things that play in your health and it's not just taking a good supplement. We believe that mental health plays a huge role in everything you do, right? And so we have things like, hey, say three things about yourself, positive things about yourself. There's so many people that walk through this world and all they do is they beat themselves up and they probably don't even say it out loud, but that voice in their head and listen, the voice in your head sounds familiar because it either sounds like you or it sounds like someone that hurts you really bad or someone that just means the world to you that just did something. Now, here's the problem with our brain. The third one, someone that said something really great or just loved you, that voice you don't hear as often. You hear the two negative voices a lot more. So we really focus on um, with my team, I coached, we focused on mental health. We focused on speaking positivity. So there's things like that. Hey, we're going to speak positivity. We're going to get out and we're going to real love on people, reach out. So that DM or not, dang, dang, DM or bingo. that wellness bingo, get in there, tag some people in it and let's, let's make that super active. Yeah. Okay. Um, there's that. Hold on just a second. Um, let's talk CBB. CBB trip. Okay. All right. Kylie and I just got our flights booked um, yeah. for CBB Vegas. All right. The Vegas CBB trip. Um, there are a small group of you that's already qualified. Yeah. You qualified for Clearwater. Carrie found out yesterday, the day before I messaged her, and she had no clue. Right. <laughs> so she's already qualified for it because she qualified for Clearwater. Um, but those that have already qualified, you should have got an email. Um, and it said, hey, you qualified for the, the Vegas Rise. Um, it's from the 5th to the 8th. So um, you'll arrive. You have to get your flight. Everyone's got to get their flight. Get your own flight. But you get there on the 5th. Um, hotels, if you earn this trip, the Vegas trip, hotel and food are covered. Um, you'll have that covered. And then you'll, you'll leave on the 8th. But we'll culminate. Um, on the 7th, the night of the 7th at uh, the Rise Festival, just outside Vegas in the desert. Um, pretty cool thing. Um, and um, Vitafy is is hosting, is sponsoring part of it. Yes. I mean, yeah. So yeah, we get to be we're, sponsored. We're, yeah. um, so I've had this question. If you are planning on going to Vegas and you're trying to book your flights, and the event will start that Wednesday night, right? 
Wednesday night at six o'clock with right. a welcome dinner. So I think we arrive that morning sometime. Um, and then you will have, I think I'll, it, we'll start on Thursday morning and go until the afternoon, mid afternoon, early, early afternoon. Um, and then the rest of that day you have just for, you know, hanging out, we maybe go do some team bonding stuff. Dude, and, who wants to go see O, the people jumping uh, in the water off that yes, stuff? That place you have is, not gone to us. I can't say it. I'm just it's amazed. Away. I don't know. Yeah. I just remember it's O. I wanted to see Michael Jackson. It was sold out. So we went to O and I, it was great. Right? It was so, great. So, yeah. So, and then Friday morning, we will wake up and they will bust us all out. To I the think desert. they're giving you the morning. Oh, giving the morning. The morning's back to you. Um, so you kind of get that span to, to pick and choose what you want to do. And then that right after lunch, I think they feed us and then we head out. Okay. We will get all the details. Yeah. Yes. But let's book tickets to Michael Jackson carries. <laughs> Right. Uh, but anyway, that kind of gives you an idea. There is nothing on Saturday. So um, if you, you know, plan on being there in time for the six o'clock dinner on Wednesday and then Saturday morning, whenever you can right. head on out. So. And so we'll get more info. I apologize for not having everything right here, but it's still kind of being worked out. Um, if you don't qualify and you want to go, They'll let you buy your way. Yes. You can you can, you can um, get a, get your your hotel room and uh, have your food covered. Or I've got a couple buddies that are coming that are part of it. They didn't qualify. They're like, I love Vegas. I'm coming. Yeah. I get free rooms out there all the time. So I'll just go get my own room, and uh, we'll come to the stuff. We'll go to Rise, and and we'll kind of do our own thing. And so um, you can you can come and join in. Um, you can bring a significant other. You just got to pay their portion um, to share the room or um, or if you, I mean, I, I didn't realize so many people, I had no clue guys. So we don't, we've been to Vegas once so many people get free rooms out there. Like you go there just enough times you get free stuff. Right. And so I've had other people say, I qualified, but I get a really good room at MGM. So I'm going to stay at that room and then I'll just walk over to wherever we're staying, you know, so you can do it however you want, but just know it's the fifth through the eighth. Um, you come in on the fifth, you leave on the eighth. Um, rooms will be covered on Wednesday night, Thursday night, Friday night, those three nights. And then you leave that Saturday. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yep. So we're good. Ours are booked. Um, I, I'm excited. I'm getting there a little bit early. Um, just cause I love just looking around at all the cool stuff. Yes. So, yes. and if you do it during the day, you don't see the crazy that goes on at night. And I <laughs> don't try to avoid this. No, the architecture in it Vegas is, cool. is absolutely amazing. So. Um, yeah, we will be confirming. If you didn't get an email, just let us know. Um, and I'll, we'll be. Well, if you didn't get an email and you thought you needed one for yeah, earning the clear water, let us know and we'll yeah. go back and check that. Um, and then we'll go from there. So that's um, doing DMO bingo still. We're doing wellness bingo inside disruptive wellness. We've got CDB trip going on, right? We just did Ship Republic and Ship Republic. There's, I think, uh, between 30 and 40 people there. Mm -hmm. um, I think 33 was the number um, that I counted. Uh, I could be a little bit off on that. Um, Joey got up and shared his testimony. For those who don't know Joey Kelly, um, my gosh, go back and watch that. Um, his testimony is powerful. Um, I am. I need to tag everyone that we've ever put in that group um, in his testimony. It was just so good. Um, and it was a great event, um, Christina and Pam, and um, who else helped? Uh, Sally. That? Sally. And I'm trying to think, Christine, Pam, Sally. Um, I know Char well, I guess Charity wasn't able to make it there. But yeah, <clears throat> a lot of amazing ladies. But it was right. a great event. Yeah. And great so event. we're going to roll that into another event this Saturday in Little Rock, Arkansas. So I will get the flyer. Uh, Merit, that's Merit. it. Yep. Yes. Yep. Sorry. Um, so, guys, I am terrible with names. The guys <laughs> that I coached, or the kids in my school, I called them uh, Sir, Ma'am, Bud. Um, the, they got those names a lot when I couldn't come hey. up with them. Hey, hey, you <laughs> over here. Um, so, um, that group was great. And we are going to, like I said, roll that right into um, Shift Little Rock. Yeah. Right. And so I will. What I'm going to do is tomorrow morning, um, I've got a post scheduled to go out in disruptive wellness for Shift Little Rock, right? 
And so um, that will be in Disruptive Wellness. I'm also going to share. I need to go back and tag everyone in the, uh, the post. But the flyer will be there. You want to invite to it, great. And then what we did different was we did a live inside Disruptive Wellness yeah. while we were at um, Republic this weekend. I think that was great. Yeah, we better I than a the lot Zoom. Of feedback. Yeah, I, I I feel like quite a few people have gone in and watched that. Right. You know, I've get, I've been getting messages. I think Dr. J's been getting messages. So, um, yep. and the, yeah, I there's been so many people that found value. Did you guys find value in having that live? inside disruptive wellness so you felt like you were there but then also hey, there's been a lot of people tagging their why don't we do this it. i'll just create an event for you to invite people to so they can watch it when we go live okay inside disruptive wellness okay. that yeah. way you can go in and just yeah. invite whoever you want will that work for you guys okay you yeah, know yeah yeah no i i i'm sure I think that a would be lot better. Of people have commented we do the event now. If I make that not a post, but an event tomorrow morning. Yeah. Um, I don't know if I can schedule an event, so I'll, I might just make it done in the morning, but we'll do that. That way you can invite to it. Yeah. So if they can't be there physically, you can be there um, online. Yeah. Nope. The, I, think, I thought the live was great. But yeah, so I'm super excited for this. I think that we're going to have quite a few people in the uh, Rock. Yeah. So if you know anybody in the area, I know Ashley Brandon, she's not on here there and they had an event for a church family function tonight. And so um, I think she's driving two hours. It's hot couple. springs, two hours. Yeah. So if you know anybody in the area, send them over. How these work is we keep track of everyone that comes right. and we make sure that they let us know who invited them. So say, um, say, uh, Karis ha has um, somebody in Arkansas and they've sent us, they'll just say, hey, you know, my friend Karis sent me here right. and, you know, then we make sure and put that down so that we right. know and to get them back to you. So yeah. we, this is a safe thing. It is a safe place. We want to make sure that your people get sent right back to you. So right. there is no, just a disclaimer here. There is no. Um, and if I. If I'm on the lookout for them, what I do is I just message you and say, hey, so-and-so showed up. Or we like to take selfies. So yeah. It'll make you jealous. Yeah. That or we send got a to picture. Yeah. And it. then that way you can, uh, um, that way it's already there. And yes. you're like, hey, and that way you can send your link to them um, or however you want. Hey, speak of the devil. Speaking of Ashley. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so that's how that works. This is the last one that we've got on the schedules right now. Yeah. So if you would like one in your area ryan and i love to travel um prefer you pick a weekend yes weekend would be nice um and then you know we can coordinate schedules with our kids but we we love doing these these are very um powerful i mean everybody this is our fourth one yep. that we just finished so this weekend will be our fifth i'm telling you guys every single person that comes if they are not already a part of the vitify family as a customer or as an entrepreneur, every single one of them become a part of the family. And um, I mean, it, it is, right? Everyone right. left at, with a bottle in their hand or a link to sign up for a kit. Yeah, you couldn't sell anything inside the, the place. I saw some people heading out to their cars yeah. to, to buy product from the different distributors that, that they crazy. came with. It's, uh, uh, but yeah, this is, oh gosh, is that four or five? We've four. already done five. We've done four. Okay. Yep. And so, yeah, these are very successful. People just love the face-to-face it... -face interaction. And then, you know, Dr. Jeremy, if we can't be there in person, Dr. Jeremy was able to zoom in. Yeah. Um, so even if you want to host one yeah. and we can't make it, yeah. we can zoom in, right? And so Dr. J can zoom in and share his testimony and, and share, you know, the, the different the science. the science behind it and everything. Or, you know, we can always do things like that. So um, if we want to, I mean, crap, you can do them any day of the week if, if Zoom yeah. is okay. Yeah. Um, that being said, on top of that, listen, we are getting close to fall. Kylie and I, in our very first network marketing business, how we built our business was vendor events. We went mm -hmm. to so many different little yes. vendor events and shows and health and wellness expos. Um, so I would be on the lookout and I've seen Ron 
Ron's been doing. Yeah, right. Ron's already. Um, I have seen Ron be, has been doing these, and I get jealous. So I'm like, I love those. You just get to meet so many people. You get to see new things. So if you um, are looking to try to, you're trying to find a way to reach out. I'm just going to tell you, those vendor events usually cost you. I mean, you want to go to big ones, you're going to cost a lot. But just the the little ones, hundred bucks, fifty bucks. Some of them are only fifteen dollars. Um, some of them are cheap. Um, but I found the people walking around, I find a couple, but the people that usually join are all the other people with booths. They're like, what do you got? What are you yes. doing? And the next thing you know, you've made six or seven new friends. And then, um, then they're, they're in, I remember one company, I, I will never forget Miss Cookie. Yes. Miss Cookie is the sweetest lady I've ever met. She made edible arrangements and uh, I went down there and I just love fruit and chocolate mix. It's like, mess that up right so i was going down there and spending any money we made on an edible arrangement and eating it and uh before you know she come down she's looking around she's like what i want to do this i want to be a part of it and so just the relationships that were built as you set for a day or two um is good yeah it's really and good yes and the thing is is that they're all like-minded right they all understand a, a a side gig or a full-time gig whatever it is they all understand it and so yes those are those are powerful. Um, you know, you could do the online vendor events, but being that face-to-face, -face, just getting to, there's a difference in, you know, just sitting. It just seems to. It's more personal. Yeah, it just seems to be working and the testimonies have been pretty powerful. Yeah. It's like taking disruptive wellness and making it like you can walk into yeah. a store called disruptive wellness and it's just right there. Oh, so it's those testimony. We just, it's just it's good. It's not just somebody just made something up. And right. This is, okay. Yeah. Not what we need. Yes. Okay. So. All right. Now, let me do this. Just a second, guys. <laughs> so we're going to be moving in. Uh, it's those of you that just changed everything, you missed out. You should have been on this live, right? <laughs> um, so we'll be moving into the fall. It's going to be good. Um, and we'll just keep running. Um, with a whole lot of momentum. Like yeah. the momentum is, is there and we have one event moving to the next. Um, and, and I am, I'm pumped. I'm excited. I, I so just, cool. yeah, I just feel this. You, do you ever get like, you can just feel like something is happening, but you can't explain it. Like it's just this, this buzz. It's a, it's a newness. Yeah. This it's buzzing like a, in yeah. your, yeah. It's that, that new season, a new, um, opportunity, but same opportunity, but I feel like we've gotten all the kinks kind of out yeah. of the system. Okay, kinks. You just reminded me. September, the first week in September, I would be expecting the launch of your e-wallet. So no I more know. checks <laughs> ever going out unless you get on your e-wallet and say, I want the check. Maybe you like yeah. mailbox money. Maybe that's fun. Yeah. Right? For me, not so much. I don't like mailbox money. I prefer just right there. So the e-wallet will work this way. Money will be transferred from V to Fi directly there. Like it's just automatically just going to be sent. It, it'll be no hands involved. This is not something that people will have to go and do each individual. So it'll be sent and then you will set up your virtual wallet, how you want your money. Yeah. You want it direct deposit into your checking account. Fine. Yeah. You want to direct deposit into your savings account. Fine. Do you want it on a prepaid charge card? Where you get your money, I think normally this is the way it worked on the past e-wallet we had. You always got your money two days early. So like if you did the card, yeah. um, whenever they release the money, it's usually two days later before you would be able to have that from e-wallet into your account. People that had the card, they already had the money, right? And so th that's yeah. that's good. Um, and you can request a check there if you want that. Um, but that e-wallet should be not making a hundred. I'm not making total promise here, but I really feel pretty confident about the first week of September, um, it being rolled out. So I, okay. I think I have my notes from our polishing. So the card it's immediately on there for, you have to accept the amount Okay. and, and then I'll go directly right to your account. So, yep. So okay. it'll be good and it will be more efficient and there'll be no more of these. Hey, I didn't get paid or oh wait i found a check i did get paid i don't know why the check came i was getting ready no more yeah that yeah. stuff goes out the window. did you so. share with them that we got a new country manager no um we had some new people hired 
Um, so um, Karloff is still our country manager for the U.S., but he now has an ass- kind of administrative kind of a, assistant. Administrative assistant. Someone he's working with that's going to be focused. His focus is going to be USA. No, USA and Europe. So that's going to be where he focuses. And then we hired a new consultant that is only focused on customer service Mm -hmm. and working on our customer service. So you will see a Zendesk coming. He speaks fluent English very, very well. Yes. And so, and he will be teaching customer service what? Uh, it's, It's been funny. He's been going a week now and there's been some phone calls to some people like, Hey, I got a weird phone call. Um, so-and-so called me and it made no sense because we were, he has stirred the pot a little bit where some people are like, I got to get my act together. And so they're, they're yeah. really trying to get it. So I am. Yes. And so if you've worked um, in, in this industry, some of you may have experience with Zendesk. Yes. Jerry got a call from Peter. So yeah. Zendesk yeah. is what we're moving our customer service over to. So the emails are quicker text messages, phone calls, that kind of stuff. So it's, a, you know, it's, it's a quicker response. Well, his, he prides himself on the, on the last two companies that he, he's been in the industry for 30 some years. Yeah. Um, but the last two companies he consulted with, within a certain amount of time, and I don't remember the time, he moves them to one call, one email, um, final, not finalization. What's the word I'm looking for? Um, your problems are fixed with one call or one email. No email back and forth, back and forth. One time. That, that, that's what he prides himself on. Yep. Uh, I don't know what the word I'm looking for. Maybe there is no word. Um, but uh, that that will be coming. Yep. So we have both of them. Super cool. Oh, um, and if you come to Vegas, you will get to be the first to see the rollout of our new starter kit. Oh. But... When I say starter kit, I mean, we're not changing the enrollment kit. We're changing what comes in it as a welcome, right? right? So pretty packaging with good stuff in it, right? Yeah. So that that's still in the works on details, but... Um, One call resolution, there it is. <laughs> that's what I was looking for. There are other people. Uh, that's why we do this together. We're better together, right? Yeah. Um, you guys be the brains and I'll just be the hype. Like I can just yell real loud yeah. and stuff like that. Um, so yeah. that will be good. So you'll get to see like a, a welcome letter. It comes and they open up the box. This is welcome to Vitafy. Thank you for da da da. Yeah. Here's the, this is, so we're going to see some really cool stuff. Yeah. And I mean, you guys can give suggestions. I would love for you to give just some suggestions of what you would like to see in there. I suggested some some branding things, maybe just a simple, you know, because we got to think cost, right? Inflation is is crazy. But I thought maybe stickers. some little stickers, you know, decal stickers. You can put them on your notebook. You can put them on your whatever, your water bottle or right. whatever it is. Yes. Yep. Yeah. And so just something. So you guys, if you're like, hey, I've seen this before or whatever, I would love this. Some branding so that you have some ownership in the company, right? right. And so, um. That's going to be launched in Vegas. So I'm super excited about that because that is something that I'm like, been, you know, I've brought up to Shane a couple of times and he was like, you know, we got to get X, Y, Z, the most important before we can get to that. And so we are finally to that, which is the fun stuff to me. And so I love it. Um, how to use. I like it. How to use. Yes, 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 yes. So that is one of the things I said we need. Um, and one. Juan suggested in like the enrollment kits to come in with a, okay. And um, now these are your steps to follow. Join this group, make sure you're part of this, make sure you have this, this, and this all done. And so that's going to be on the card for customers. I suggested that we do a card that has all the different ways to take it. Right. So you can take it because I don't know about y'all, but I answer that question all day, every day. And yes, girl. Yes. I see Carrie shaking her head. And so, uh, you know, maybe a visual with hot or cold liquid or however, veggie cap, that kind of stuff. And so, and we're working on that. We're just working on 
can I just remind you guys where we were a year ago, everything was in Spanish. <laughs> Whenever Ryan and I joined, we brought Carrie in. Everything was in Spanish. So we have come such a long well, way. Well, I mean, my mom was the very first online customer order. They'd never had one before in, in five years. Six, five years, y'all. Five years. No, none of the none of the Latin American yeah. market had used the online platform. We were the first ones to come in and actually use the online platform ourselves. It was not in English. So hello. We now have this amazing um well I don't even think I enrolled or Carrie enrolled or Dr. J. I think we all had to I have one Ron, enroll us because yes. we couldn't speak Spanish. I, and we all filled out paperwork, y'all. Yep. We all had to yeah. Fill out paperwork and like fax it to me or email it. I, I can't remember. Email some stuff, no. Yes. So we've come such a long way. So now we are getting to the point where we can be like, okay, here in the US, this is what we want, right? This is what we need. Right. And um, this is what we expect, right? We we're a different yeah. culture. Well, and you're gonna see um you're gonna see a change in the we have a Vitafy corporate page. You're gonna see that overhaul. Yeah. Right. I'm so and it's excited. gonna be branded. It's going to look good and it's going to be something that you can use yes. um, because I know some of the top income earners in network marketing for other companies, like seven figure monthly earners. They joined that company because of the corporate Facebook page. Yeah. Right. So we're going to work on that. Some of that's going to be changed. Yes. Um, I had someone call me out today. I need to be called out from time to time. <laughs> we have a disruptive wellness Instagram account. Mm. Y'all, oh, I'm so sorry. I forgot we had it. I started it. I started working on it. We built it. I think there's 20 some posts in there. Yeah. And then the whole new system came on. Yeah. Hard, and, so and so we're going to get back to pulling the stuff that's in disruptive wellness over into the Instagram page mm -hmm. for those that don't have people with Facebook. Um, and then you still have um, uh, the YouTube. I put everything on YouTube. I understand the account says Life by Stokes. But guys, I don't put anything on there that would bring anyone back to me. It's just literally, I was like, I don't know. I think Selena might have even been on this, but Dr. J was for sure. We were sitting there and I was like, I'm just going to put everything on my YouTube account. They keep it for free. My <laughs> computer's just filling up. And so I've put everything we do out there on that YouTube account. Lori, you are so good. No, yeah, no, no, no. I love right? it. I need it to be well, this morning. We, it's one of those things that was out of sight, out of mind completely. So right. thank you. We appreciate yes. it. I am not upset at all. Um, so there is an Instagram um, disruptive wellness account. I'll do a better job um, and get, get more stuff on there. And guys, what I'm going to do is just pull anything in disruptive wellness that's good. Um, if I can pull it over and put it on Instagram and make it look a little prettier. Um, okay. If she can make it look a little prettier, cause I ain't doing that. Uh, I don't have that capability. Um, then we'll get that posted. Um, and if there's someone else out there that would love to help me with that, take on that role. If I can make people dual um, admins on that, I have no problem um, sharing that with somebody. Yeah. Yeah. I see no one is volunteering. Okay. Um, suspicion. I was trying. Um, so, um, there's that. Um, and then, yeah, yeah. So we're pretty good. Um, there was a, um, no, I think that's about it. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. We had the, uh, we had, uh, Vitafy made a video, um, for Kylie and I, um, since we were the first English speaking, um, distributors, um, coming to the company. There was a little video they made. I posted that on um, YouTube. Um, but it, it was kind of cool. Just kind of us telling the story of how we got there and, and how things were brought in um, and where we're at now. Um, I don't know if that would be useful for anyone else, but it's, it's out there. Mm -hmm. um, and so I think if you're wanting to get your face on a video that Vitafy puts out, Come to the CBB event. If you, if you, if you earn it, come um, because you can use that to market yourself, right? Hey, I was there at the, um, you know, the first Vegas CBB trip um, that they did for the English market or, mm -hmm. you know, whatever. So, um, yeah, I think that's it. We've kept them long. Enough. Yeah, sorry. We just have so much to say and we just love you guys so much. Um, so remember real quick, um, we starting the opportunity calls back tomorrow night. Or we're going to wait until next Monday. 
Um, well, we always have Thursday's opportunity call, and I believe that's super successful. Um, and, I, and, and we probably won't ever stop that. Um, Monday nights, we were doing a business opportunity call. We haven't done those in three weeks. Um, Just life. Yeah, life. And then I don't know what's needed. I don't know if you guys need something like that or if you need me to get back to doing the Tuesday and Thursday morning trainings yeah. where we connect and uh, we launch people and do that. If we need to get back to that. Um, I have no problem doing those um, now that we're back to normal. Yeah. So the idea on Monday was bi-weekly month. Okay. Okay. We can do that. So, so bi- next Monday, let's give it, so every let's promote Monday. stuff better. Okay. I'll do a better job okay. with that. And so the idea for the Monday uh, weekly, or I'm sorry, Monday uh, opportunity call is business um, focused. So, you know, us sharing just a real quick, you know, Reader's Digest version of who we are at Beautify, how we got here, what we're doing, and then some testimonies, and then end it with Q and A, right? Um, so that is for business focus right. solely. Right. Thursday night, our weekly drop is absolutely amazing. Dr. J does a great job. Those testimonies are always powerful. If you didn't get to hear Jennifer or, or Jenny, I call her Jennifer because her name always says Jennifer, but it's Jenny. Jenny's uh, story on Thursday was so powerful. We were all in tears. So those are just a, our, the goal behind these calls is to set you up for success, to give you tools um, to, you know, to use to grow your business, right? It may not be something that you're comfortable with, but if you can plug them in to what we are providing you guys, yeah, you know, that that's what they're for. Yeah, I need to get Joey on there. I cried at Joey's on Saturday. Every time. Joey gets me to cry every time. Up um power hour oh i yeah. love those yeah Carrie, Carrie loves power hours um um yeah Carrie. um so um real quick we skip here longer remember when we invite people to disruptive wellness um if you invite them not share the link but you literally invite them then that's going to be enough, but I would love for you to tell them, hey, make sure you tell them you, you answer the question. I invite you. Now, that we will approve all those. It's when we share the link. So when you go and you click share and you share the link inside another group or you share the link with someone, you really need to connect with those people and say, hey, once you click on this, this will take you to our, our testimonial group. Make sure you answer the question or you won't get in who invited you and put full name. All right. Full name would be great. Some of you, we only have one of you. All right. But there's others. We have multiple of you. And so we don't know. So um, and the reason why we do that is to protect you. It's to make sure that you do the work, you get rewarded for the work Mm -hmm. and a customer doesn't end up with someone else. Yeah. Right. And so um, we found it's better off just decline them than accept them because declining leads them to coming back and go, why didn't I get in? And we decline with feedback. If we accept them and then someone else grabs them, now we have hurt feelings, yeah. right? So yeah. we do this as protection for you. So And our admins do a really great job of monitoring and everything. Yeah, I'm scared to death sure. to approve someone that doesn't have. Um, yeah, Carrie. Carrie, is, she get me, right? Yes. Oh yeah, we've got it. Yeah, watch against this this spam yeah, account. Yeah. And then sure. here's the other thing. Um, I not we're not biggest fans of you inviting 497 people at one time. Um, it, it's it's not my favorite thing to go through and approve and check because we don't do approve all. We do each individual. Um, but I would say for you, it's not the best either because there's no connection. We know connections key. Okay. So if you're going to invite some people, invite, I don't mind you inviting 15 or 20, but a connection there, message them, let them know, hey, I just invited you to our group or, hey, I'm going to invite you to the group. You got to check this out. This thing's awesome. Right. So go down that road. Mm -hmm. We good? Yeah, I think so. I think we're good. Carrie's nodding. Yeah. I haven't seen Dr. J. I think they're doing bedtime right now. Yes. Um, I think we're good. Ashley, we good? Oh, we got a question. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You'll have to it might keys. be. It might be locked. Is there a question? Lisa. Hey, Ryan. Yeah. 
for for people who don't make these meetings, um, I think I think a, if there's a system in place to 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 say when you sign people up, make sure you tell them like what you just said. Don't invite all everybody on your friends list. Yeah, just you know invite people you know individually people you've made connections with only because they won't get approved if you just invite all you know it won't okay. be effective so if we start start passing it down like you know for those that aren't on maybe maybe put that in world, world changers or in the chats that you know going forward when you enroll people let them know this is how you do it. This is how you go about inviting people. Yes, we want people in the group, but we want to do it the right way, you know. Y yes, ma'am. And I think we've done a couple ad tag message, um, how to work the, the group, but we can do another one of those videos. Mm -hmm. Carrie? Also, like if, if, I mean, obviously you guys too, but like if we see people that are adding and <laughs> like you're inviting people, it tells us who invites them. Mm -hmm. So those people we have no problem approving it's the people who requested me in the group. It says they have a couple of people or a couple of groups in common or a couple of people in common, but they don't answer the questions. Those are the people that we need to reach out to. And I try to send a message and decline with feedback. And I'm like, hey, you know, make sure you answer the questions. Or sometimes if I have no idea, I'll message that person and say, hey, who invited you to the page? You know what I mean? How did you hear about it? because we want to make sure that you're connected to the right person. But I can't do that to every single person, but neither can y'all. Yes, no, good right. point, good point. Yeah, hey. All right. Thank you guys for showing up. Yeah, Selena. Yes, yeah, send the invite. And then, at, yeah, ask them to make sure. Yeah, that. just inviting people is great. Yeah, yeah. that It's when great. you share the link that they, they're not connected. They're not connected to, to anybody. Mm -hmm. So that's unless usually, they answer the questions okay because i usually i send them i tell them hey i'm going to send you an invite and then i have them give me an emoji or hey i'm in i can see it or whatever then i go in and tag because i explained to them i can't tag you in the video that's so awesome until you do that so yeah right. I, love I just that. wanted to make sure i didn't need to yeah that. No, and if no, you that's listen great. if you invite them and then share the link with them mm -hmm. they're tied to you yep that works so invite share the link they click on the link it just takes them straight to that and they're already tied to you because you invited them. But if okay. you shared the link first and they go and you haven't invited them yet, then it's, that's where it's at. It's just, it's just okay. Facebook ties you with an invite or it ties you with the questions. That, that's the only way we know. Awesome. 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 We're good. I got a couple messages. Yep. We're good. We're good. Okay. Awesome. All right. Love you guys so much. Thank you for showing up. Thank you for your feedback. If you guys have some ideas um, or questions, please always feel free to reach out to us. Right. Right. We are here to serve. And we'll post this inside Disruptive or not inside World Changers so you can tag your team in it. Yep. All right. Can, so, I, can guys? I say one thing yes, before you all go? So I just want to encourage people to, to um, be generous. I had a friend who I gave a bottle through my back office at cost mm -hmm. and she just bought the 1000 kit. <laughs> so Whoa, don't girl. be afraid to be, to be generous and, yeah. you know, don't make it about money. If you make it about helping people, you give them a chance to really try something they might be nervous about. And she's, she's my friend who said she got her 17 year old ankles back. <laughs> Uh, and, and and she's like 50, she's 54 and she's a year older than me so she's 54 and awesome. yeah so she just bought the 1000 kit yeah you you awesome. you change it from um a number right i i know i've shared with some of y'all we've been a number before when you change it to um you're on a mission to change lives instead of change your pocketbook um things change yeah right there's a shift in your mindset and in your heart and your mission becomes um, more powerful. Hey, and make sure on all new enrollments, we get them, we celebrate them, or we introduce them inside Welcome World them. Changers. Welcome them yes. um, inside World Changers. Oh, and celebrate. Hang on one more time. I'm so sorry. There's so much that we had on our heart. Be watching for a celebration wall, y'all, okay? 
And this is a celebration wall inside of World Changers that is just going to celebrate those of you who are just doing yeah. the things, right? right? It doesn't matter about rank. It doesn't matter about any of that stuff. Title, rank, none of that. It is you are going out there and changing lives. So right. be watching. That will be starting this week. And uh, we will keep you posted on that. So super exciting. A lot of new stuff coming. More lives. Okay. Oh, okay. Deal. Yep. We right. can do it. All right. All right, guys. Thank Love you. Love you guys. For real, this is a Southern goodbye. <laughs> See you.